Earth is a great place. We live here, but plastic is unfortunately hurting our world. Since plastic was first invented, it has ended up in oceans, landfills, and all environments. Not a single place in the world has been untouched by plastic, and that is horrifying. Half the plastic we use is designed to be used just once and then thrown away. Even plastic that can be reused or recycled gets thrown out. What is plastic? Plastic was invented in 1907. It's made from fossil fuels. Plastic became popular because it was strong and does not break down. It is also very cheap for companies to make. Over the last 10 years, humans have reduced more plastic than during the last century. There are seven common types of plastic. Number one, PET or Polyethylene terephthalate is the most commonly used plastic. PET is used for drink bottles, food jars, and lids, and even clothing. Number two, HDPE or high density polyethylene is strong and used for milk cartons, toys, detergent, jugs, and pipes. Number three, PVC or vinyl. Polyvinyl chloride is hard plastic. It is the most dangerous plastic to human health. PVC is used for plumbing pipes, credit cards, human and pet toys, teething rings, and medical tubing. Number four, LDPE. Low density polyethylene is a softer and flexible version of HDPE. It's used as a liner inside drink cartons. LDPE is also used for cling wrap, bread bags, bubble wrap, garbage or grocery bags, and drink cups. Number five, PP. Polypropylene is the most durable type of plastic. It's the most heat resistant and is used for straws, bottle caps, hot food containers, yogurt cups, packaging tape, and disposable diapers. Number six, PS. Polystyrene, also known as styrofoam, is rigid plastic that insulates very well which styrofoam is considered a dangerous plastic that can leak harmful toxins. Styrofoam is used for cups, takeoff food, containers, packaging, and egg cartons. Number seven, other. This plastic category is for all other types of plastic that don't belong in numbers one to six. Number seven plastic is used for eyeglasses, baby, in sports bottles, electronics, and cutlery. Number seven plastic is not recyclable. What are microplastics? Microplastics are created by plastics breaking down. They are smaller than five centimeters. 51 trillion microplastics are floating around in the ocean. Microplastics move up the food chain. Fish eat the plastic, then we eat the fish with the plastic. What are noodles? A noodle is a small plastic pellet used to create almost all plastic products. Single-use plastic. Single-use plastic is plastic that is used just once for a short amount of time, then thrown out. Bad single-use plastic includes plastic bags, plastic bottles, granola bar wrappers, and many more. Most plastic is used just once before it's thrown away. Sing single-use plastics are illegal in some parts of the world. What are the problems with plastic? We use too much plastic. Humans have created 8.3 billion metric tons of plastic. That's the same as one billion elephants or more than 800,000 Eiffel Towers. Two million plastic bags are made every minute in the world. The average time that a plastic bag is used is only 12 minutes. Tens of billions of chip bags are sold each year by companies like PepsiCo. Plastic ends up in the ocean. Single-use plastics can end up in the ocean. 
This is really bad for animals and ocean health. 11 million tons of plastic ends up in the ocean each year. About a truck's worth of plastic enters the ocean every single minute. By 2050, scientists believe there will be more plastic than fish in the ocean. More than 7 trillion pieces of plastic are floating in our oceans. 700 different species are in danger because of plastic. 10% of all dead animals found at the beach are tangled in plastic bags. Six pack holders can get around the necks of animals and can kill them. Plastic makes it difficult for fish to breathe and for crabs to grow shells. Around 1 million seabirds die a year from eating pieces of plastic. One in four fish caught for food has pieces of plastic in its gut. 11.5 trillion noodles end up in the ocean every year. Ocean animals mistake noodles and microplastics for food. The plastic piles up in their tummies so they can't eat. Eventually, they starve. The Great Pacific Garbage Patch is a plastic island that is double the size of Texas and three times bigger than France. This plastic island is a collection of litter in the ocean and seas. The garbage sits near the surface of the ocean. Plastic ends up in landfills. A landfill is a place where trash is dumped. Trash is buried in a big hole. Plastic trash is often incinerated or burned, which releases toxic chemicals into the air we breathe. Plastic never disappears. Plastic bottles take 450 years to break down. Fishing line takes 600 years to break down. Plastic is also hurting people. Plastic gives off toxic chemicals that we breathe, eat, and touch. People can have problems with pregnancy, behavior development, thyroid, low birth weight, diabetes, obesity, asthma, and cancer. Our health and survival are in danger. What are people doing to help? What is a change maker? A change maker is someone who takes action to solve a community problem. They put themselves before others and keep trying even when it's hard. Who are some change makers fighting plastics? Two sisters who are fighting against plastic are our main unique. They created Kids Against Plastic to help reduce the use of single-use plastic. They made change at their own school by encouraging reusable lunch boxes, and they picked up more than 90,000 pieces of trash. Chewie Sleesfield is a teenager from Australia and protects the ocean by cleaning up trash. She wrote a book and has a website called Plastic Free Schools. Sharon Levine stopped for Mosa Plastics from building one of the biggest plastic plants in her community. Second grade parent Annie Farman has been an active member on the board of the Plastic Pollution Coalition for 10 years. She and her team of global leaders are working to stop single-use plastic and its harmful effects on the environment. What can we do? Recycle. Recycling means to take materials ready to be thrown away and change them into other materials. This is how you recycle plastic. One, make sure it's clean. One single dirty product can contaminate an entire bill. Two, don't mix plastics. Look at the numbers. Three, recycling bins are blue. But wait, recycling is not the answer. Recycling is a myth. Did you know that only 9% of all plastic is actually recycled? 
That means about 91% of plastic goes to the landfill. Some people call recycling recycling. Recycling is putting something in the recycling bin and hoping it will be recycled. Reuse. Reuse means to use something more than once. This is how you reuse plastic. Instead of recycling or throwing something away, use it again. For example, instead of throwing out a peanut butter jar, wash it and use it to store snacks. Reduce. Reduce means to bring down the number of something. This is how you reduce plastic. Avoid single-use plastic. If you go shopping, remember to take a cloth bag. Refuse. Refuse means to show that you are not willing to do something. This is how you refuse plastics. Say no when given the option for single-use plastic. Do not buy single-use plastics. This is the best choice. So what do we do? Try this. 10 impactful swaps. Instead of using crystal geyser water bottles, use your own reusable and refillable water bottle. Bring your own mug or thermos to the coffee shop or say no to the lid when you get coffee or hot chocolate. Instead of using plastic containers for your lunchbox, use metal containers. Instead of using a plastic toothbrush, use a bamboo toothbrush. Instead of using Ziploc plastic bags, use reusable containers, silicone bags, or wax paper. Instead of getting food packets like ketchup, mustard, hot sauce, soy sauce, say no thank you and keep your own sauces at home. Instead of getting balloons for celebrations, use flowers. Second grade commitment. In second grade, we each counted how much plastic we have at home. We discovered that we all use a lot of plastic. We found things like plastic shopping bags, food containers, jars, lids, bottles, and Ziploc bags. The most common single-use plastics that we found at home were snack wrappers for foods like granola bars, cookies, chips, crackers, cheese, and candy. These wrappers are not recyclable. So second grade decided to do something. We decide to refuse all snack bags. We are committed to refusing these snack bags for at least a month and hopefully much longer. This challenge is hard. After all, we love snacks, but we know that this is so important and we have to do something. The second grade is committed. Can you join us and infuse all snack bags and wrappers too? For a day, a week, a month, a year, forever? This is why we need to make a change. We have to stop using single, use plastic, and take care of the all. Please join us in saving the earth by not using single-use plastic. We should save our world and save ourselves. We can do it!